Hello, my name is John Belazikin, and the instrument that I play is called an oud. I'm what is known as an oudist, that is a person who plays the oud, which is this instrument, a Middle Eastern string instrument. It uh, originally comes from Persia, its origin. It has, uh, in its present form, 11 strings made of nylon and silver-wrapped nylon. It's braced in five pairs of two strings with a low 11th string, which is uh, a bass string on the oud. It has no frets, which are metal bars on fretted instruments, such as a guitar, banjo, or mandolin. And uh, the back of this particular instrument is olive and walnut wood. It's a very unique instrument. This was made by an Armenian in Istanbul, Turkey. His name was Onik Karibyan. This is an original 1928 Karibyan, which is very, very rare, very old, and it's in excellent condition. Uh, one of the other unique parts of this instrument is that it's played with an eagle's feather in the right hand. Not a guitar pick, it's played with an eagle's feather. The oud uh, is traditionally played in what we call a system of makams. And those makams are based in quarter tones. And uh, those quarter tones, there's a whole series of these primary and secondary quarter tones. One can play in what I refer to as diatonic type of music, which is, means diatonic two-tone system, which is our Western harmony. And uh, we can also play in quarter tones. Why? Because we have no frets. So any fretted instrument cannot play a true quarter tone, which is also a very interesting facet of this instrument, which has gained a lot of notoriety the last 30 years or so, at least with American people that have taken the instrument and used it for fusion rock and roll or tribal music or this kind of background uh, usage of this folk instrument.